ahead and use my Neutrogena liquid lotion. It's a sunscreen. I don't go anywhere without it. And I'm gonna just put on this NYX eyeshadow base because I really want these colors to pop. So I'm just gonna put that on both of my eyes over my mobile lips. I'm using this NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil in Milk just to go over again. I really want these colors to stand out so I just use this as a base just to make these colors really look sharp. Now I'm going in with the color Petals. It's from Morphe and I love this color guys. It is so gorgeous and I'm just going to use my finger to pat it on. But then I remembered I have new brushes, so I'm pulling out some new brushes. So that green brush right there, it's um, the 778 brush, and it's just a shadow brush, and it really, really is good for applying um, colors really well. Like, amazing, amazing application on this brush. Love it. Now I'm going to go in with the color, I think it's car. Cam caramel, I can't even say it. caramelized, and I'm just gonna go in my crease area and blend out that nice color. I'm going to use this palette from Black Radiance and I'll put the name of it somewhere. And I'm just using that light gold in my brow area, underneath my brows for a highlight. And I'm using my Urban Decay 24 7 Perversion Eye Pencil. And I'm just going to. <laughs> I was having trouble. I always have trouble when I'm tight lining. It's such a weird and uncomfortable thing to do. And I'm using my NYX Noir Liquid Eyeliner just to do a wing. And that tape is really helping me out. <laughs> Now I'm taking the tape off and I'm using my Smashbox Full Exposure Mascara. And I'm going to use my BH Studio Pro. This is a matte pressed powder in the shade 255. This is the last shade. And I love this powder. I'm just going to use that all over my face. Now I'm going to use my BH Cosmetics Bombshell Bronzer. This is, a, this is a bronzer called Siren and it's amazing. It's for any skin tone, any skin tone. It's just a gorgeous bronzer. Now I'm going to use this uh, blush from City Color. It's called Be Matte Blush. And it's in the color Blood Orange. And it's really pigmented and such a gorgeous color for the spring. Love this color. It's so gorgeous. Now I'm going to use my Mil Milani Matte the 61 and Matte Naked. It's like a nude and I'm gonna go in with another Mon Milani lip gloss and it's that purple there I love the mixture of these two of I'm gonna put the name of that somewhere in the screen and I just love to put that on top of this color it looks really really nice and I'm gonna use that brush there to it's like a contour brush and I'm just going to use some of this bronzer and use it as a highlight. It looks so friggin' gorgeous when you highlight your cheeks with that, your um, the high points of your cheeks. And I'm just going in to um, put that in my waterline area. Thanks so much for watching, guys. Don't forget to share, like, subscribe, and comment. I'll be reaching out to lovely ladies for collabs. And don't forget to stay tuned for some DIYs and more beauty looks. Well, to peanuts. Sausage pieces.